I didn't have to push me like that. The guy was a Jamal. They could have talked to him to save his ass. Uh, not with DiMaggio in the play. <laughs> <laughs> hey, dude, what do you call a dead Jamal? A Jamal, you schmuck. The guy had big colliones. I'll give him that. It's Dean. Dean, what are you calling me? You know what time it is? They whacked Willie. Santelli did it with his own hands. That fuck. I saw him do it. I can put this guy away for life, Hank. All right, just, just slow down a second, okay? You saw Santelli kill Willie. He took his head off with a baseball bat. You saw Santelli kill Willie with a baseball bat. With your own eyes. You fucking deaf? Stay put. No, 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 no. It's getting too hot. Get me out of here. No, no, just stay put. You can't do anything until tomorrow. Listen, you prick. I can't. Hank! I will cover everything. Expenses, salary. Just disappear until we need you. Think of it as a change. What, what do you mean a change? There's going to be an appeal. Victor, take this cut off to the airport. Right. The airport? What, what are we going to the airport for? We got to put you in mothballs. You're all that stands between life imprisonment and freedom for Santelli. Well, where am I going? The Sierras. The Sierras? They're in California. Uh -huh. What about my stuff? All right, take care of that, sir. The town? Cap. Alone? Yeah. Take a lot of balls to do what you did in there. No. What Willie did in there took a lot of balls. All I did was my job. Do not shortchange yourself, my friend. Take some credit for character. Whatever it takes to keep Santelli off the streets. Attention in cell block D. Anderson, J. Give me a fact. How's it going? Oh. How's it going? These freaking lawyers of mine, they tell me they're working on my appeals. I could have bought Long Island for what I'm paying the pricks. <laughs> I hear you. Did you get an address yet? I'm working on it. That's not good enough. I still can't believe this fucking kid Dean took me down. Look, it's hard to read a man with no loyalties. No, he's got loyalties, Nate. They're just not ours. I made a big mistake with this kid. Luke, everybody makes mistakes. I want to erase this one. All I heard so far is that he's somewhere out in California. California's nice this time of year. Always. <laughs> they have no seasons out there. That's why I like it. <laughs> That's what I hear. Luke. We need an address. I'll find out. Everybody's got a price. I just gotta find a seller.
That's my breakfast. Get it out of there. <laughs> Just keep it up. All right, keep it up. You'll be in that play tomorrow. Thanks, Dennis. So, you think the Knicks have a chance to win this year? Ah, uh, with Ewing out, with Starks as cold as Joe, forget about it. Yeah, and at those prices, I can't afford to watch a bunch of losers. Come on, Hank, you're loaded. Ah, uh, those are the old days. Yeah, Hank. Uh, Dean, my man. Dean, my man. Oh, my man, your ass. You realize I've been sitting out here over two months and I don't work from you about the friggin' appeal? <laughs> I got some news for you, pal. I'm out of here. Out of here? Sounds like you're losing it. Losing? Hank, what, 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 what the hell do you expect? I'm, I'm out here in the boonies with a pack of coyotes and I got these crazy chickens following me around. I mean, I got enough eggs up here to choke a pig. It's driving me nuts. All right, I'm coming out. When? Stay cool. All the chickens, you shoot all the coyotes you want. Just stay put until I get there. Give me two days. And Dean, if you walk, they'll find you. Find me? Hank, how the hell are they gonna find me? I don't even know where I am. I'm history, Hank, all right? Said Telly Woods. No, you can't allow that to happen, Dean. Just give me two more days, and I'll take care of you. All right, Hank. Two days, okay? Just two more fucking days. Got some problems? Nothing that a good offense can handle. Uh, Mr. Santelli, uh, treat me like a son. I think he wanted me to see any ugly stuff. Ironically, it was a good position for an undercover agent. You're in the middle, but uh, you're really not in the middle of the battle. But one day you did see the ugly stuff. Yeah. I didn't know that they uh, found out that Willie was undercover. What did you see? They had him tied up in a chair in one of those batting cages. And uh, this that automatic ball inside. machine was uh, we'll firing later. shots at him repeatedly. And uh, I got a word from my girl. Buster, Buster. What'd you say? Scream at Oh, great man. Oh, my gosh. I just got all the beans. Nice, nice dish of Brazilian with meat sauce. Santino? Yeah. Santino? Do me a favor. Here's what we're going to do after we get out of here. Pour Santino. Mr. Santelli. Your Honor, I have asked him three times to stop talking. Your Honor. Uh, I'm sorry, Your Honor. Fuck <clears> that. Why didn't you try to stop them? Well, actually, me and Willie discussed what we would do if we uh, got discovered. And, uh... uh no, yeah, yeah, you ever tried buffing an 80s music like, uh, like, like, like Elvis Costello? I have never buffed Elvis Costello. Yeah. I used to like to buff the Barry White. Barry White's too difficult. Nah, I don't think we'll stop right here. Stop. Here you go. All right, look, I got to take care of something, all right? I'm going to be a minute. All right? Now, wait here. Anybody ever tell you you remind them of a handsome Hunts Hall? <laughs> Hunts Hall? Yeah. Thatch? Yeah, for me, you say kids. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Hunts Hall. I love you, kid. Hey, steak, wait in the car, all right? 
Just wait here. some light. Oh. Mario. Cut the machine. Are you dumb? Or do you just like pain? I mean, how many more times you want to get hit in the face with a baseball? Now, it's real simple. Just give me a name. It's, it's, bad, bad. Bad. it's okay, Mario. A lot of balls, I'll give you that. No pun intended. Hey, Street, let me have that back. Batter up, boy. Yeah, batter up. Did you ever see my Joe DiMaggio impersonation? Did you ever see it? Ah! I can't hear you. Hey, what did you say? I said... Ah! Willis. You know what time it is? They whacked Willie. Who? Santelli did it with his own hands. That fuck. I saw him do it. I can put this guy away for life, Hank. All right, just, just slow down a second, okay? You saw Santelli kill Willie. He took his head off with a baseball bat. You saw Santelli kill Willie with a baseball bat. With your own eyes. Are you fucking deaf? Stay put. No, 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 no. It's getting too hot. Get me out of here. No, no, just stay put. I can't do anything until tomorrow. Listen, Frank, I can't. Hank. Mink. What are you doing out here? It's place in the bay. I thought I'd want you inside. Well, uh, between you and me, I uh, wasn't on Sam Pelly's horse. You keep a secret? I got a hot tip abandoned lady at the fifth. Fast for him. Smooth as ice. I mean, this is fucking floor ice. Want some action on Willie took the fall for both of us. And he never told them a thing. the driver for the FBI. A little information, it go a long way. I want you telling me where they take him. You have the family, Victor. Why do people 
the lie. Of course, you have the family, Victor. You have the wife, Sara, the bambina, Jessica, and the little bambino, Victor Junior. My sister, she called me from Italy yesterday. Uh, she called me all the way from Italy, from the Abruzzi, to tell me that I'm the zio. I have the nephew. I will never meet my nephew, but I love my nephew. <laughs> Did you peace? Why are you not tell me where they bring him, eh? You tell me you're gonna go home. You're gonna go home a long time ago, you know how? Just click you heel three times together. <laughs> My family in Italy. They're like the polizia on the American television. We always get our man. This is funny because you are the FBI and I'm telling you the Italian television story. How do I know I can trust you this time? I am so close to it, I can touch it. I've heard that before. Treat it like a vacation. Cute little cabin in the country. Besides, he's lonely. Well, there are a lot of lonely men in this world. What makes this guy so special? He's not special. You are. Is this for the FBI or for you? This is for you and me, baby. So then after this, we'll be even, right? Sure. Yeah, right. You know, if you were an Indian, you'd owe me your life. I'm not an Indian. <laughs> okay, I, I'm an innocent woman who was in the wrong place at the wrong time. Sure. And with the wrong man. And what are you, the right man? Could be. Oh, you're a piece of work, Hank. You know that. Coming into a lot of money real soon. FBI doesn't pay that well. Tell me about it. I was thinking. If you, for once in your life, could have everything that you need. Everything. What do I have to do? Not much. Cook, clean, take care of the house. Get close to him. And what if I uh, like what I'm getting close to? <laughs> you gotta be kidding. You got me. What do you consider serious money? More than you can imagine. Twenty years ago. This would have been us on the Brooklyn Promenade. A promenade? Nah. Nah, that was the old days, the promenade. You know, they had character. No more. Now they got sunshine and guys running along in shorts. <laughs> we got out just in time. Now these loyalties don't mean nothing no more. You see the way they got Santelli. <sighs> Life is solitary. It's hard to believe. 20 years ago, you had to have some balls to eat the guy's food and then hang his ass. 20 years ago? They didn't have Viagra. <laughs> this the guy here? Yeah. Yeah. Hey. How was that? Fanny Crash. Yeah, stop me here. Frank, sit over there. Frank, Wolfredo. 
Alfredo, how you doing? Valfredo, with a doppia V. Walfredo. Catch his name. Catch it like Frank. Hey, guys, we gotta work together. All right, listen up. Frank drives. He knows that part of the country. He's our West Coast man. I used to be. I'm out of retirement for this. It's very nice. Santelli wants two men on the job. All right. Grazie. Take these. Cash advance, driver's license, and a picture of the target. Do you have any idea where they're holding this guy up? The second I hear you here, I'll fax you at your place. All right. Okay? I'm a Vinny. Okay, Frank, take me back to the boat. Come on, Walfred, we'll have a glass of wine, huh? You know, in the Abruzzi, where I come from, we know use of the fox for the killer. It's a very nice thing. Oh, thanks, huh? Yeah, what do you use over there? Uh, we use uh, we use the telephone, we use a lot of stuff. We don't use the price. Davy Crockett. That goddamn time, Hank. Well, I told you two days. And I'm here. A champagne and a friend. Dean, this is Monica. Dean. Yes, I know. Real nice place. Did you build it yourself? Uh, no. Actually, I, uh... C could you excuse me for one second? <sighs> Cute little cabin in the country, huh? Well, it is in the country. So every time this guy does a job, he gets caught. So one night I'm cuffing him and I say, Johnny boy, I said, why do you keep doing this? I said, your average take after doing time is less than what a dishwasher makes. So he says, it's what I do. I don't know how to do nothing else. So I said, Johnny boy, you don't know how to do this either. <laughs> don't quit your day job, huh? That used to be funny, what can I say? Hey, no, 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 I gotta go. I got a plane to catch. Uh, you want me to go? I can. No, no, no. no. Why, why don't you? Uh, why don't you stay? You know, I, I got a loft upstairs. It's, it's very comfortable. It's like having your own room. I, I mean, it's uh, very, very comfortable. Hey, what is this? A peace treaty or something? She's staying. What do you want it in writing? I'll send you a letter, huh? Hey, don't get up. I can show myself out. All right, there, Hank. Yeah, princess. Well. Why you live in a house with a light on the roof? Makes it easier to find my way home, Stunard. Okay. Watch your feet. Hey. Frank, you live like the pig. Except for where the fox is. You gotta keep your information organized. That way I don't kill the wrong man. You're that busy. Yes, I'm that busy. I used to be that busy. Sometimes during a year, I, I spend one week in L.A., the next week I'd be in New Jersey, I'd be in Bayonne or Hoboken. If I stayed in the family, I might have ended up in a Brucey. Oh, we could have had dinner. I wouldn't have been there for dinner. Take that. You like the guns, eh? Yeah, well, you got your way, I got my way. Do you know that in uh, 1540, Camillo Vettelli from Pistoia invented the pistol? That is why they call it the pistol. Pistoia, pistol. Uh huh. Then why don't you use a pistola instead of a knife? Because the pistol make too much noise. I like to be silent. 
What is this? This is a medical insurance kit. Just in case one of us is dumb enough to get shot. I know I get shot. I too smart. Intelligent. Probably live down here, though, huh? Yeah, that's the guy I thought when he built us. Mm. A champagne? Thanks, Hank. Uh, hey, uh, how well you know, Hank? You, you, you don't have to answer that. Honestly, it's probably none of my business. A long time. I see. Well, uh, here's to, um... Survival. Survival. I like that. Who knew Dean's exact location besides you and Victor? No one. You think he talked? I don't know. How about the girl? Uh, she's with me. She's as cool as an iceberg. You sure about her? Why would I screw this up? My career depends on Santelli's conviction. So if she does a job, I maintain my reputation. Santelli loses his appeal. Everybody wins. I know Victor's wife, Hank. Jesus. What a way to die. The Italians are the only ones who uh, still do that shit with the balls. It's a hangover from the old school. Sir? Hank. Let's be cool about this. Now, moving Dean out of there at this point is a problem. These guys obviously have an inside line. I want to put a few of our guys out there at the base of the mountain. With all due respect, sir, you can't just send three men... No! Now, you go out there and set it up. This is your baby. Don't screw it up. Santelli will do anything to reverse his conviction. I do not want to see him walk. Yes, sir. Hello. Hey, Princess. Hi, Hank. Can you talk? I can. That was the uh, cute little cabin in the country. It's cute. Did you get the wine I sent? We did. Thank you. How's my cowboy? I think he's happy. I don't much care if he's happy. I'm just glad he's there with you. Such a nice guy, Hank, you know What? Nothing. You know, you sound so... Very far away. It's because I am. Oh, I gotta go. Come on. Who's that? Everything okay? No, oh, I. What are the potatoes? I still haven't learned how to cook. She's gotta go. This is Jay. He works with us. He and those two recruits are going to be stationed at the foot of the mountain in a trailer for security. What's going on, Hank? Not to worry. Well, the, uh, if there's anything that you need, Jay's your man. The appeal's getting real close, so Keith wants to make sure that you're properly covered until the trial. Not a bad setup. Not a bad setup at all. Excuse me. I want you to make some coffee. Listen, cut this shit, Hank. 
been up here for four months without anybody at the bottom of the mountain. What happened? They got Victor. Victor Tomsack? Oh, man, the guy had a family. Look, look, they don't know what he told them, okay? All we do know is that we can't lose you. And this Joker's all that stands between me and Centelli's hitman? Hey, I could go back east on the next plane. It's not like I'm happy to be here. And no offense, pal. Just got a lot on the line, you know? A little chumpy. Victor didn't talk. You get your blood money. Congratulations. A million dollars in non sequential youth bills. Nice. And he has the address and the directions and a little map. Move over there where I can see you. What's this at the base of the hill? That's a trailer with three of my men in it. I can get two of them out. You can handle one man in a trailer now, can't you, Nate? One more thing. Don't kill the girl. What girl? There's a girl up there. Tell you boys not to kill the girl. Hey. She gets in the way. We do what we got to do. Tell you boys not to kill the girl, or I'll call her before they arrive, and Dean may just disappear. Fine. To the deal. Let me tell you something. I don't like men with no loyalties. For example, I don't like cops. But if they believe in what they're doing, and they go down doing it, so be it. I can respect that, but you, you don't believe in nothing. You're the scum of the earth. Get out of here. Thank you, Dr. Freud. You have a good evening. Sorry. God. No, no, no. We gotta go up this way right here. Up this way? Yeah. You're out of your mind. You go up that way. Doesn't matter. You never climbed a mountain before. As a matter of fact, no. And that freaking thing is gonna strike. <laughs> you stay exactly where you are. Don't move a muscle until I tell you. On the count of three, I want you to roll out of the way. All right. One, two, three. Go. <laughs> I cannot breathe, Frank. Breathe through your nose and shut your mouth. 
Why you have to be like this? Why you always like this? What, are you getting sensitive on me? Killers are not sensitive people. Yes, but you say just breathe it through your nose and then... My nose is not just for the breathe. My nose <laughs> smell of the woman, smell of the flower. My nose is saving my life. What did it do? It kept you from banging it. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> It's very funny. FBI! Yeah! <laughs> you guys are getting better. Kiss my ass, Jay. I hit six out of six. Oh, bullshit, Gary. You missed six out of six. I hit six out of six. That juice is mine. Now <laughs> oh, you're both lousy shots. Yeah. <laughs> See that hawk? <laughs> All right. Call here. All quiet, yes, sir. Oh, believe me, that's fine with us. Yeah, let me take down the point of rendezvous. You got good news, share it. All right, yes, sir, right away. Well, how was Hank? He's sending us to Modesto. Yeah! Woo! We're out of here. Thank God. No, Jay. <laughs> We're out of here. They're sending me and Gary to Modesto. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. You're just gonna have to stay here in, uh, what did we call it? Nowhere, Nowhere land. land. Nowhere land. So what would you be doing if you weren't here with me? Sailing the Mediterranean. Pulling into little ports. Dipping homemade bread into dark green olive oil pressed that morning. Smelling roasted garlic and strong Parmesan cheese and... Staying in hotels with her, she's here. All right, all right, the truth. Teaching some poor defenseless woman how to use a firearm. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Wow. How about when this is over? I don't find that far ahead. I've found that plans are like rules. They're, uh, they're both usually broken. Well, that's pretty harsh, don't you think? I say I'm a little jaded. I think you're pretty terrific. What about you? What are you going to do? Uh, I don't know. Sail the Mediterranean, pull in little ports, drink only the finest of wine. <laughs> that sounds like a good plan. You guys lose your way. <laughs> must be ladies' night. <laughs> Um, it's been two hours, man. No rendezvous. What do you think? Don't make waves. We got our orders. No, we need to do something. It's your call. Yeah, I'll call Anderson. Anderson. Hey, you watching the game? What? Who is this? It's Eddie. Eddie McCall. I'm here with Gary Shub. Who's winning? I'm working. How's everything at the trailer? Oh, no. We're not at the trailer. We're here in Modesto. Modesto? What the hell are you doing in Modesto? <laughs> well, you're kidding, right? I mean, we got orders to come here. Orders? Whose orders? Well, Hank called us. He told us to come up here for a rendezvous. Jay, still back at the trailer. No, 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 no. Get your asses back down there. Move. Something's gone wrong. Now. Y yes, sir. We're out of here. Come on, man. We gotta get back to the trailer. Let's go. Hey, Eddie, what's the hurry? There isn't a plane till morning. can't sleep up there anymore. I'm having trouble sleeping anywhere tonight, actually. May I ask you a question? Sure. 
they hire you to do this? It's a favor. Rank? For all of us. Can I ask you another question? If Hank wasn't involved, would you still be here? Come on, those secrets. What were you thinking? Why don't you take a break? Sounds good to me. Peace money fine, too. I never thought I could make them. Damn. What's the matter? Nothing. What are you crying for? Because I'm happy. I don't know who you've been hanging out with, but where I come from, this is definitely not happy. I, I don't want to lose you. Why would you lose me? Because I always lose. I just... Hey, 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 hey. I'm not going anywhere. Okay? I'm not going anywhere. Get out of the car. Hey, 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 keep your hands where I can see them, buddy. What the hell are you doing up here anyway? Oh, oh. oh. hey, hello. The throat is off limits. You're not supposed to be up here. Hey, don't listen. I'm with the FBI. I'm here on official business. Now you guys are going to be in a world of hurt. Shut up! You know, I always wondered about these places. Where, where do you keep the bed? You bed. <laughs> Shirt. She's a destroyed. It's only blood. It'll wash out. <coughs> this 
smoking is the filthy hobby. <laughs> you put away your sticker, I'll put away my sex. I like my knife. I like my sex. This man, he know us? Did you ever meet him? How do I meet him? I only be here. What the hell is he gonna know us if you don't know him? In Abruzzi, I'm a famous. I don't think anybody around here even heard of Italy, let alone Abruzzi. Walfredo, Abruzzi. Who the hell knows names like this? Anybody who comes from the Abruzzi. My father was a born there. He's a father before him, and then he's a yeah, father. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? These shoes are new, and I, I don't want to go on this road with these shoes. I think we should drive a little closer. These shoes are no good for the killer. That's what I just said. They're nine, they're gonna leave footprints. Now, come on, let's go. Make sure you close the windows, too, because I don't want too much fresh air. When it wants, glides on the wind, swoops down and picks what it wants and settles. Dean. Yeah. We expecting company? Shouldn't be. Draw them up the hill away from the house. When they're gone, I want you to get in the truck and get the hell out. No, I'm not leaving you. Look, it's me they're after, all right? If you don't hide, we're both going to be dead. Come on. Should have a walk up here. I don't walk in snake country. On these shoes. Snakes scared the shit out of me. I ain't no scared of nothing. Saw a garter snake at a wood pile back east once. I stayed in the house for a whole week. And that was my vacation. I hate snakes. No, no, wait, wait, wait. Just wait. I don't can wait. Why don't I have the patience to wait? What if the guy, he see us, he started shooting? Nobody saw us. Anyway, cops like this, they don't shoot until you shoot first. That way they rationalize killing. This means this rationalize. Well, rationalize. What the hell difference does it make what it makes? Why are you so rude? Look, well, I am going to count to three, and then we are both going to get out of the car at the same time, all right? So just listen to me. One. Two. 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 What, did you see something? No, I just just have to go. You son of a you stick to the plan, Stuart. When I say you wait till I count of three, you wait. One, two, 
three. If you, for once in your life, could have everything that you need. All right, you, uh, give me a hand here. on the rocks. What the hell are you laughing at? I'm the only Italian who loved the war. Yeah. the first Italian to be shot in the war. You stand up and you see you find him. You stand up, I cover you back. All right. There you go! He's running away! We should have a walk up here. Huh? We would have surprised him. See the woman on the hill? No. The woman, she here. My nose, no lie. I think your nose is working overtime. You ought to keep your eye looking out for that rat. Frank, when you deceive the friend, 
and then they hide you so you can deceive the friend again. What do they call this? The witness protection program. And you're not married, and you wanted the company, the woman. They pay for this. They do what they have to do to keep you on ice. Frank, he's in the hills. What if he run away? Uh, where's he gonna go? The nearest farm is like 50 miles from here. If he had a woman here, well, why would he leave her? Maybe she's ugly. You hear this? Hear what? The woman, she here. Uh, yeah, Somewhere. I, you don't stop all this crap about the woman, I'm gonna shoot you. Hey, wait, wait, wait. We're in America now. That's just an expression. You understand? It's an expression. <laughs> like the joke. Yeah. It's a joke. It's a joke. Like I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot you. It's like a joke. Yeah. Now you go up there. I watch the camera. He want us to follow him. He's protecting something in here. Do you know that uh, in 1,564, Dr. Fallopio from Padova invented the condom? We Italians, we have to make many great things. The condom is just the one. You're awfully nervous for a header. Just to stay here and wait. I don't like to kill the woman. If I have any luck, she'll kill you. Your woman will kill me. And why not? Because the woman, they love me. Yeah, is that a fact? I wish come back tomorrow. You crazy. Santelli feed you to the fish. It's better. He come down to us. Yeah, he'll come down to us. Knock on wood. What is knock on wood? Knock on wood is like a superstition. Knock on wood. In a Pucci. Have a many old town with many hidden passage and rooms. Miss, uh, I have the confession to make. We just kill you, man. Si, morto, dead. Pero, uh, he, he the nice man, but we the men too. Uh, but the men have to do what the men have to do. We have the job. Miss, we don't like to kill the woman. You the woman, uh, but you the woman of the trouble and the worry. If you not come out, uh... I am tired of this. Jesus. No.
your gun. Alfredo, we got him. Drive a little faster. Oh, I can't you die a little faster. You go like the turtle. Uh, shut up. Oh, damn this road. No, oh, nothing is smooth in this country. Not the woman, not the road. Will you just shut your mouth? You're gonna talk yourself to death. And you're no. gonna talk me along with you. The woman in the cabin, you should have shot her. I should have shot her. You were supposed to be the big head man from a booty, right? I should have shot her. God. Follow, no? She follows. Yes. 
enough of this shit. In Italy, they invented the jeans. Shut up. In Genova, because they make the blue cloth, and in Genova, the jeans, in Genova. Will you shut the hell up? Oh, I don't know. I can't sell all this so bad. Never stay on the road. Push this off the road if you remember, you idiot. Oh, we go up, foot down. Now we die. You're not gonna die. You take this. Okay, with, with this. Ah, uh, medicina. It's morphine. She no kill me. I... The woman, they love me. Are you sure? All right, Alfredo. Ciao. 
To the country, city boy. I'm stuck here. Get me out. What's your name? What's your name? Frank. Nice to meet you, Frank. Get me out of here. My, my foot is stuck. But... If you move, they'll strike. Uh, I'm not afraid. See, I like the sun. Warm. Are you warm, Frank? You look a little warm. Mm -hmm. You know when they bite? You know what happens? Fangs are hinged from the roof of their mouth. And if they lose a set of fangs, you know what happens, Frank. They grow a new set in 15 minutes. Imagine that. My gosh, I've learned a lot about snakes up here. <laughs> I should have killed you. I should have shot you when you were in the fucking hole. Here's a terrible thing, isn't it, Frank? I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid to hear you, bitch. Always hiding in some corner bun in the back of our mind, just waiting to uh, jump out and make us do all the wrong things. Uh, I've done a lot of wrong things, Frank. I spent most of my life afraid. But I'm not afraid anymore. You see, Frank, if you lose enough love, you lose your fear. It's what they call a paradox, isn't it? You are a crazy bitch! Crazy bitch! <laughs> The more you panic, the faster you'll die, Frank.
Monica, it's me, Hank. Where are you? Come on, Monica, cut the games. I'm not in the mood. I got the money. Some serious money. That's you, Monica. You might as well come in. I think your knight in shining armor's in here somewhere. It's enough of these games! Now stick to the plan! Where's the money? That's my girl. Always thinking about the money. Well, I got it. It's everything we dreamed of. Everything we talked about. It's down below. It's in the briefcase. In the car. All right, Monica. That's it, honey. Either I'm coming out. Oh, you're coming in. Huh? That's enough of this. <laughs> you know that old adage. If you love someone, you... Set him free. If they don't come back, you hunt him down and kill him. Hank. What happened to you? Why are you here, Hank? <laughs> the deal. What are you talking about? What deal? You told me to look after him. Come on, honey. There you go again. The wrong man at the wrong time. You no. Know, you look ridiculous pointing the gun at me. Ridiculous? <laughs> I look ridiculous. Have you looked at yourself lately, Hank? You're a mess. You're a manipulating, deceitful, sorry son of a bitch who has dreams that he can't even afford. You disgust me. Why don't you take your goddamn money and get the hell out of here? It's a million bucks. Everything that you could ever need. Now that's more like the baby. Oh, 
It's a good one. It's a good one. We're gonna have to make this look good. You're a person. in your life could have everything that you need. With all that money, we could sell the Mediterranean, huh? I thought you were dead. <laughs> 